Um, okay, so I make films, and um, I already I have um, made two principal films. One is called L'arrière pays, um, the land beyond, and the other is uh, La fièvre, uh, which is a spell of fever, and both are talking about um, a story of exile about um, a woman, which actually is my mother, uh, who were a political refugee from Morocco, communist uh, refugee in France. And bo the two films are talking about this exile, but in an uh, oniric way, in a very, like, uh, science fiction, almost science fiction way. These two films, which was interesting to me, is the link with um, History of Morocco, particular history of Morocco, but um, in the particular way of um, a, um, a regard, um, I think it's been used to regard a, a regard of an, an exiled yeah. woman, and so which interesting me in exile is the way that it's um, uh, suspend history, uh, past and present are completely mixed in exile. It's really produced a very specific um, link to time and also to history. So uh, it was in, in the both films, what's interesting me. But in the second film, which is called A Spell of Fever, La Fièvre, um, I, the déclic, the, the, the um, thing which really gave me the uh, desire to make this second film was that in Morocco at this time, um, there were this, in, in all Arabic uh, country, there were the, um, what we call the Printemps Arabe, uh, Arabic Spring, Arab Spring. And in Morocco at this time, it, it wasn't yet uh, happening. So I, I was wondering how Moroccan will uh, react, uh, will react um, in front of these revolutions uh, in Arabic countries. And what's happened that where I, I came to film um, and to, uh, it's happened just when I was there. So um, this there, there was huge um, called the manifestation, um, yeah, um, demonstrations. demonstrations. Uh, and it was very strange to be there and filming just, um, in the middle of all that. And it was very strange for me to, to, um, to be in this way, to uh, asking mouse myself what's happened f of this old uh, um, revolt, um, revolution. not revolution, but the rev um, my parents were communists and their, uh, their lutte, their, um, their, their fight, were completely forget uh, because it was a uh, Marxist fight in the 70s and this, uh, it was completely oh, yeah. forgotten in Morocco. And <coughs> how this new um, demonstration, this new fight, how it works together and they're completely different. I mean, completely different, but it was really interesting to, uh, to uh, interroger, to, um, to question uh, this history uh, in a way compared to what's happened now. And this forgotten uh, fights, like which were under, underneath memory, underneath history of Morocco. And it was really a, like a, a suspended time between these both uh, historic points. Uh, it's actually, I'm, I'm born in France because my parents were political refugees, so they couldn't be in Morocco anymore. So um, I'm born in France and they couldn't come back in Morocco, but I can, I could. Like I'm, I was going in holidays uh, to see my family, but my parents, uh, couldn't come back, so it. But they uh, transmit. They. Um, I don't know the word. <laughs> they, they. Uh, 
told me, they don't really told me stories about their past, but in another ways, in gestures, in, I don't know, songs, and, and a lot of, and sometimes stories, but very uh, fr fragmentaire, very pastoral stories. They told me about their past and their, I, I really felt it, it was an imaginary land because what I knew from Morocco was so different that it was for me, it was really a, a, like a dreamland that they lost. And uh, so it was strange because I have this, all these memories which are not mine, which are their memories, but it was like it was mine because I, I was really, I'm born in, this, mm, in those memories. And, um, and so it was like if I was haunted by memories which weren't mine. And so I, uh, when I was in Morocco, I really, when I walk in streets, I really have these mem memories and Im images which are not from my memory. Uh, but like ghosts, uh, ghost memories, and it, it's why when I'm in Morocco, even now, it's not very mm, comfortable for me to be there because um, it's like a double vision, and uh, I can't really be there. I'm always in between when I'm in Morocco. I'm, I can't uh, see Morocco just as a normal country, uh, it's always haunted by other things. And um, it's so, it, it's create a way to see the world and it's the, f the films are, uh, the, the both films are about that, especially Spell of Fever. So for me, it's a real documentary because even the science fiction things, it's a documentary about the perception of um, reality and time. <laughs>